So hey there, it's Miss JC, art teacher, and I was just coming to you all to let you know that I'm working on a little project right now um, to really uh, express and honor what we celebrate and who we celebrate on Good Friday. So I wanted to show this to you all, and if this is something that you're interested in doing, that you can use this project as a project instead of one of the ones that I assign for you weekly. So let me show you. Right now, I'm taking a black piece of paper, and again, I realize that not everybody has all the supplies, so if you don't have these supplies, you can obviously just do the normal assignment during the week, but if you do have these kind of supplies and you'd like a little challenge, because these projects are going to be maybe like a little deeper, they're going to be a little more uh, labor intensive to do, but totally worth the effort. So I took a black piece of construction paper and I found a crucifix in my home. So here's a crucifix that we have. And so I used the crucifix to uh, be able to mimic a picture of a crucifix right here. So if you might have one that maybe you can trace, that would be obviously a little easier. So here I did, I drew the crucifix on the black piece of paper and now I'm going to cut it out. Okay, so once you've cut it all out, now you're gonna to wanna to erase your drawing lines on the black construction paper and find a white piece of paper to put on under it. And then you're gonna to wanna to glue the black construction paper cut out onto the white paper. Okay, once you have your silhouette cut out, now you're gonna make sure that you have the proper setup for painting because we're gonna be using watercolors today. So you can see I have some newspaper down on my table and then I have the paper. So when I go off the edge of the paper, it goes on the newspaper, not on my table. I have a bucket of water and a paintbrush and then I put a little paper towel there so that I can dry it off. So now you're just going to be taking some watercolors and you just wanna dip a little bit of water in your different colors and start going across it. So for me on this project, I'm envisioning kind of like a sunset uh, type color scheme. Um, I know that, uh, you know, when we think about the crucifixion, you know, we think about our Good Friday, right? So we think about Good Friday and we know that there was, you know, a dark and dreary uh weather that was over the land and then we know that the hour of 3 p.m. is reserved for our Lord's crucifixion and then I can only imagine you know like what like the sun and the setting of the sun would have looked like during then so that's kind of my artistic interpretation of what I'm doing today you can do anything you want any colors you want because you are the artist and we want you to decide and, you know, design it the way that you feel. So it's kind of what I'm doing right now. Okay, so then after you put in your watercolor, then you can add a little bit of mixing to change the style. And make sure that you really, you know, wet your watercolors and just keep using your brush strokes right across, go horizontal back and forth to make your picture. So you can see I started with red at the top and then I did some oranges and then green at the bottom and then I added some black at the bottom as well. And then I took some of that black and just blended it in with the red and the orange. So again, I hope that you enjoy this project and that maybe this might be something that you might be interested in doing. And again, you can use this as one of your week's art projects. Um, if you would like to do something um, just a little different and you have the supplies um, to be able to do this project. So I hope you enjoyed it and I'll talk to you all soon.